beefs it up. Another Monday morning. Week nine. Feels like week 900. <laughs> here this is the process for the vein matching this is for the back wall uh, this is the up part so it's like this Ty's got the first part cut right there we got the second part down here on the back wall came out really nice the vein matching was key again on this one ties right now outside matching for this wall it's gonna be three across and then four tall so we're doing that so we'll be back in a second and we'll capture videotaping this thing Done for the day here. Um, this afternoon didn't go smooth at all. It seemed like nothing would go right for us. Uh, we got it done though. This wall was uh, very tricky to do, especially around the curb there that cut. And uh, I don't know. It just it just didn't. Go smooth. Everything we did seemed like we had to do it twice or three times. But it's done for the day. Uh, didn't get everything done, obviously, who I wanted because of it being so slow. But it is what it is. We move on and we'll be back here tomorrow to finish up the last wall, do the marble sills, and then start on the floor. Here at uh, Design on King, Benjamin Moore store, with uh, the boss Jack Payne. There it is. We got our favorite employee, Nicholas, in the back. What are we picking up today, Jack? We're picking up some uh, samples for Project X. You know, some nice light grays. We're gonna do three samples for the client. See what they like best. And that's it. That's the start of this morning. Patches. They had a medicine closet, uh, cabinet here and we filled it, uh, added the new switches, J 
just did some mudding and taping. So we're gonna do another coat this morning and then start laying the herringbone floor. This is what the bead looks like here. I don't know if I showed you guys yet. With uh, the shadow here. That's why we didn't put the casing and we did this instead because of how close the tile will get to it. There's no way we would have been able to put trim there to make it look nice. So we just did the, the trim text there. That's how the shower came out. The curbs went in over here. Came out pretty nice. So we're gonna get moving today and then, oh, and uh, these are the paint colors we picked. We wanted to do a sample. We're gonna go with the top one, which is uh, Owl Gritty, OC52 from Benjamin Moore. And we're gonna start painting uh, tomorrow, hopefully. removed off the floor installed the aria vent uh, put in the backing around the valve there it looks pretty clean put on some mud did some sanding now I'm gonna protect the floor uh, so then after we're good to go for paint and then uh, I think that's it for today pretty much got the glass guy also coming in today to measure and he'll be uh, putting it in sometime next week. Done for the day here, uh, got all the walls painted, ceiling is painted as well. Tomorrow I'm going to be coming here with Ty to drop off the vanity, um, get it in place for Nick to come on Monday, and then after that's ready to go. It's looking good, everything's coming along, we got the exhaust fan in as well. The bead's really looking good now here, now that it's painted. I'm not really sure if I'll vlog tomorrow, but uh, if not, this would be the last clip. And if so, uh, hope you guys had a good week. That's a wrap on this week's vlog, and we'll see you back here next week.